What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here today. I am back with another live PvP gameplay and today I'm going to use the old school beast which is the Graviton Lance. Now you guys may have already seen my Vigilance Wing video. It just depends on which one I upload first. Well I've done one with the Vigilance Wing, one with the Graviton Lance which I'm doing now to see how these perform in the current meta of PvP because I've just seen nobody using them. And I don't know why, because these things used to absolutely rule PvP. They really did. Now, um, the Graviton Lance and the Vigilance Wing. Me, personally, I preferred the Vigilance Wing, but the Graviton Lance was by far the more used. Everybody was spamming this weapon. It was probably the better weapon. I just rarely use it. I prefer the Vigilance Wing, like I said. But when I did use it, I used to wreck with it. So we're going to see how it performs now in PvP. Now, the Vigilance Wing, to me... It felt a little bit slow, a little bit sluggish, a little bit left behind. The Graviton Lance, I'm hoping, doesn't feel the same way. But we will find out, people. We will find out. But before we get to the video, guys, if you do enjoy it, leave a like. It really does help out. And if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos, be sure to subscribe. But let's get straight into the video, people. Control. Okay, so... Again, guys, I said this on my Visual Swing video. First gameplay in, I am recording and posting. No messing about, no cutting shots, no playing until I get a good gameplay and then posting that, pretending the weapon's better than what it is. The weapon sucks. We will find out with the average player's review because I am average at best, as you guys know. Especially PvP, PvP wise, I am not that great. So if this weapon is good for me still, it's good for you. Oh, it just feels so weird. I haven't missed that sound either, to be honest. When it shoots. Again, this seems to... It, it seems to bounce a little more than I remember. Not that it makes any difference at all, I don't think. Get out of there! Fights together, Get out of there! Zone A lost. Come on. Come on. Come out. That dude's just shooting everybody. I take the assist. I take the assist. This is more like a scout rifle in my opinion. I can feel it now. I mean, it was kind of like a scouty pussy before, but this is a weapon. Oh, it's a telester. My respect, that is a telester. You know, I'm making a video of me spamming out of that weapon just to piss people off. Cause I rarely use it, but I know it's fun. I know it's fun. But yeah, um, it feels a bit slow. It feels, it feels like a scout. Did it used to feel like that before? I'm not even sure. It's powerful though. It's quite powerful. Zone B We've locked. used to use this correctly. But mind you, when you come up against people actually using skirts, I think that's up with that guy I was using then. It just gets outgunned. So where does this weapon fit in? Does it even still fit in? So it's definitely still a three burst. I don't think it can two burst anymore. Could it two burst before? I'm not even sure. Zone C lost. It's a power play. Get those zones back. Oh wow, left on one hit. But the match isn't over. Wow, noob just stood there. Noob just Zone stood A there. Captured. It just stood there. Zone B captured. You have zone advantage. You're in the ah, lead. Me, oh, oh, what fail? Together as one. I don't know how I survived that, and I'm not surviving. I can hear Spectra Blades. Spectra Blades. Let's see how long that thing lasts. Last person I come across using that, he had it for about 10 minutes. Oh, that was a blade barrage. Oh my it life! That guy just lagging! Lagging with the Telesto! Come on, game! Ah! Yes! 
bitch! Oh, you deserve that! You deserve that! You deserve that! Get the hell out of here! Stabbed it, yes, bitch! Stabbed it, yes, bitch! What? Gained the lead. Yeah, get panic super. I'm still confused at what happened earlier. Just like, what happened to that dude? I think he shot me with a rocket and killed himself, but I survived it after I shot gun him in mid-air. Oh um, yeah, this at range. This at range is a beast. This at range is a beast. It is it's more like a skirt. I remember you used to be able to rush in with this thing and just drill people because everything, everything else was left behind. This thing was like, just, it killed so advantage. quick considering. Now it seems as though everything else has caught this up and it's only good for one in oh, oh, it's only good for one instance and that is at a range. Fighting at a range and just so many people, the way PvP is now, not many people do that. That's why people want to uh, uh, buff the scouts. Uh, scouts just get outgunned, no matter where you use them, they just get outgunned. You've got a hand cannon that can basically two-tap you. you got pulse rifles that can two-tap you. you got... Wow, that guy's lucky! I mean, it ain't, it ain't a bad weapon. You know what, to be honest, I think it's probably better than what I remember the Vigilance Wing being, because I've used that already and it that just felt so slow. Sluggish. This feels a little bit crisper, a little bit more accurate, a little bit more potent. I don't know. I don't know, people. But they've definitely been left behind. That's 100%. I understand now why I don't see nobody using them. Nobody using them. Zone A capture. You Puss here with his Telesto. Puss here with his Telesto. Zone C lost. A close game as well. A close game as well. A close game as well. You captured zone B. Zone advantage is yours. No, I need. I'm. Oh. Bitch, you deserved it. You deserve that. Yes. Jumped over your telesto and shotgunned you in the mouth. That's how it goes. That is how it goes. I mean, a Telesto, I've seen many people complain and saying it should be a heavy weapon. I mean, it ain't strong enough, in my opinion, to be a heavy weapon unless it receives some kind of birth. Uh, birth. Some kind of birth. Some kind of buff. Some kind of buff. Burning out. Yeah, good. Yeah, it needs a buff of some kind to be a heavy weapon. I don't think they want to nerf it. You're getting stronger oh, my life. Fight. There's loads. Oh, there's loads. Even more. I can't kill any of them. I want to try and get the kill. No way. The explode flag. That's what I'm saying. I used to have clips submitted to me. Where you kill one person and then it blows up just like a void bomb. When you get a kill, it just explodes. And I had people submit clips to me where they killed one person and it killed a further five people. I mean, they obviously have to be grouped up together. He just spawned behind the sun. They obviously have to be grouped That's up together, but still. You I just want to get one. I just want to get one kill with the explosion, left. which probably ain't going to happen. I don't think I ever have had one kill with the explosion. Zone B you know. Lost. Uh oh. Whoop! You just got sniped. Uh oh, I'm not getting, that. not getting out of the way of that. Not getting out of the way of that. I was only like a 13 or 14 kill. Shoot then as well. Zone A lost. Not bad. Not bad for a scrub like me. Did I just spawn? I just spawned! I just spawned. In a super. In control. You captured zone A. Zone where we had one point. That's probably why. That's probably why. There ain't no smart spawning system in this game. You spawn where the points are you've got. Even if it's being captured by the enemies, you get spawned there. Don't matter. Don't matter. <laughs> Flip here now. Pool of. I'm done with Pool of Telesto bursts on the floor then. You are rubbish with that Shut Telesto. He's rubbish with that Telesto. Real slideshow. Wow. Well, then you, get, you come across people that just don't miss it, man. Don't miss that shit. 
no matter where you are, map Don't you with it and still get you. Zone advantage is yours. I'm just spawning. See, I'm spawning right. Well, they're spawning right in front of me. And that just should not be the case. You can get get panic super because otherwise it's gonna go to waste. Now it goes. Yeah, they're spawning right in front Don't of me, but the game bust. Kill him, boy. There you go. There you go. Don't teabag him though. That's a bit uncalled for. Mind you, he was using Telesto. Telesto uses. Deserves to get teabag maybe. Still using that Telesto. <laughs> wow, accuracy. Uh oh, he got me. Careful. Your enemy is closing the gap. They close the gap and come back. I'm raging. I rage at the very end before we lose. You know what I mean? Not really. Never do that, but I have seen people do that. I have seen people do that. So yeah, do I have a ten lance? Oh, Wishbringer. Not as good as I remember it being, but that's understandable considering how much this game has moved on. The game has you moved on in like a way a PvP is now, the meta in PvP. I mean, you got 25 kills with 5kd. Like that's not too bad, but if I was using my bygones, anything else, Lunas Hell, which weapons I've... Basically, the newest of meta weapons people are using now, this is just nothing. Let's have a look what's on that. Full spawn to a rampage, <laughs> not bad. But yeah. Small ball, accurate rounds, oh, not bad. But yeah, the Guravatan Lance is a shadow of its former self, that is for sure, and I understand now why nobody uses it, people. On that note, we have come to the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, really does help out. If you're new out here and enjoyed David Destiny 2 videos, be sure to subscribe. And thanks, as always, again, for stopping by, and hopefully I will see you on that next one.